This is TFNN, the Tiger Financial News Network. TFNN Headline News Update. Good morning, everybody. I'm Tommy O'Brien, coming to you live from TFNN, 10 a.m. Eastern Time, 30 minutes into the trading day, and we got markets accelerating higher. You have the NASDAQ 100, actually the laggard right now, technically flat. You got the S&Ps up by 15 points, trading at 44.33. You see the acceleration overnight. Now, we're positive by 15 points, but you're 40 points off of the low that we had just at about 8.30, 8.40 this morning. Now, we got a couple of data points our man Kevin Hinks called it a bit of a data dump this morning. Let's jump around to some of that data as you see the markets, right? S&P up by 14. NASDAQ barely in the red. Dow up by 180 points right now. How about the Dow? Are we going to see 35,000 soon? It's possible, man. Dow just popped almost 300 points from where we were trading at 8 a.m. this morning as it's up 170 points. 34,456. The Russell positive by two. NASDAQ 100. The only one slightly in the red but I mean, talk about nitpicking. You're pushing basically highs that we had almost yesterday sitting at 15,190. Remarkable. All right, let's jump through some of the headlines in the morning. The ECB hikes again, and Lagarde calls the July increase very likely. I was listening to some of that press conference. Uh, they went to 3.5. One of the questions had to do with, do you see what the Fed was talking about? Would you guys maybe do something similar, something to that degree, and it made her speak to the next meeting, and she was about as sure as she could be that they're probably hiking in July. Pretty strong words, especially strong compared to what Chairman Powell said when he was talking about the July meeting. All he called it was live. She said that they're very likely to raise. So you see the comparison there, and I think it's playing out today in the markets on the heels of that. What else did we get? We got retail sales this morning. That's a strong number, man. 0.3% is the number. Far above estimates, and uh, and yeah, and then you go to what Chairman Powell was talking about. You get the journal saying they're likely to raise because guess what? He misspoke. He said the word skip, and you're probably going to hear some Fed speak coming up, and that'll be the most interesting part over the next couple of weeks. But guess what, man? It's Thursday. Tomorrow's Friday. We got a long weekend happening. I'm not sure anything gets in the way of this market right now, as has been the case recently, as we're pushing highs near in the Dow. And you're only about five points away from the highs of yesterday in the S&P. 44.39, we just got to a high of 44.37.25. Stay tuned, folks. We got our man Basil Chapman. He did his program at 8 in the morning. So that's coming up right now. Live programming after that, folks. Have a great Thursday. We'll talk to you tomorrow.